Hello guys, in this short video I want to show you one important technique or trick if you will not used often enough which is about prompting AI. So how to get a better quality result closer to what you expect. And this is a mistake or unused opportunity I see quite often. The developer prompts the AI, whatever is the agent or LLM or tool, it may be cursor, it may be cloud code, it's the same thing. So the prompt goes like this, and then the result is often like this. I tweeted about it recently. So AI starts building the code, generating something, and then 10 seconds or 30 seconds after, you go, no, no, it's not what I meant. But this is my question to you. Have you told AI what you actually meant with your prompt? And in this case, I'm not talking about putting more context to this prompt. I'm talking about transforming this prompt into a dialogue a two-way conversation between the developer and the AI instead of a usual one-way conversation. So all you need to do at the end of your prompt, add something like this. Another sentence, ask me follow-up questions. And now look what happens if I launch that prompt in cursor. But it would be the same or similar thing if I did that in cloud code or whatever else. Look, the list, it comes up with list of questions. So it hasn't changed any code yet. Although I'm using agent, I haven't chosen ask mode. So you have the questions like relationship type. Should it be one to many or many to many? This is important. Another question, project fields. Are these fields okay or you want something else? Task relationship, required or optional. Do you have existing data? And then do you want me to create filament resource as well? Of course, in this case, my initial prompt is just one sentence and I haven't actually given enough details. So it's asking for a lot of details which are important. But even if my prompt was a bit longer, there are some details I may have totally missed. And then we often blame AI for going off the rails, but actually maybe we don't give enough information in our prompt and the best way to ensure the clarity is to allow AI to ask us back. So the next step is to answer those questions by AI. I answer them in just numbered format. And now if I hit enter, it will start to actually generate the code. Now it understands the requirements better and create the to-do list and what relationships are required. Everything now is more clear. Now I will stop that. What happens next doesn't actually matter. I want to show you the principle. For better quality result from AI, we need to talk less about the tools and more about the context and the prompt and the feedback that we can give to AI model to generate better results. What do you think? Do you have any similar techniques or tips or tricks to provide more information into LLM as a context? Let's discuss all of that in the comments below. That's it for this time and see you guys in other videos.